Leaders have pledged a further 500 million euros in military aid for Ukraine at a meeting of G7 nations in Germany. Swedish leaders have voiced their desire to become NATO members following Finland's decision to make an official application of NATO membership this week. Britain's Foreign Secretary says in the face of Russian aggression, European nations should embrace unity. It's very important at this time that we keep up the pressure on Vladimir Putin by supplying more weapons to Ukraine, by increasing the sanctions. G7 unity has been vital during this crisis to protect freedom and democracy and we'll continue to work together to do just that. The sudden urge to join NATO by the Nordic neighbours has received mixed responses. Italy's foreign minister says his country will support the move, but Turkish President Erdogan says the proposed expansion of NATO is something he is not positive about.